Hello, welcome to jasonnewland.com My name is Jason Newland This is Sleep Hypnosis Weekly Please only listen when you can safely close your eyes I'm lying down on my bed as I record this. I don't do that with any of the other recordings, but I quite like to actually make a recording whilst at the same time actually drifting off to sleep which happens most times when I lie down on my bed hear the ruffling of my pillow possibly that's the bed clothes the duvet I'm moving that and I'm just laying down on my left side I really can feel a body just letting go mm. and you can just join me in this experience this shared experience not just with me, but with other people around the world who are listening to this now. Find yourself a comfortable position, maybe the same as mine maybe you want to lay on the left side on your bed maybe you prefer to lie on the back on your back or the right side or maybe on your front you can change your position at any time in order to increase your comfort just let you know when I yawn it's a genuine yawn I don't do fake yawns unless I'm on a first date and it's going really badly <laughs> then I'll start yawning oh I feel so tired all of a sudden I must leave I think there's something really, really nice about just lying down, you know? I think there's 
sometimes a bit too much pressure that we put on ourselves when it comes to sleeping as if it's almost a chore like it's a it's a challenge or something instead of the natural thing that we're born to do so easily so then maybe we sometimes put unnecessary pressure on ourselves almost to perform to perform sleeping even though sleeping isn't a performance it's just a natural thing it's almost the opposite of action Just falling asleep, drifting off, it's literally doing nothing, it's just laying there. just get your mind around the idea that there's nothing magical about sleeping it just happens it's an automatic process just like going to the toilet just like digesting food when you have your meal you eat something you don't spend the next four hours concentrating on the digestion of that food If you asked anybody if they did that, they'd say no. Probably, you'd probably laugh at the idea. And if you said to them, "Why don't you, why don't you focus for four hours on the digestion system? Why don't you focus on that food digesting?" in your stomach and they'll say because I don't need to it happens automatically and no one would question that I think very few people in the world would question that logic it happens automatically in the same way we don't need to focus on our kidneys or our liver or our lungs or our heart or our brain or our spine all that stuff happens automatically the same way as sleep happens automatically it's just an automatic process that for whatever reason we may have built up 
some kind of drama and tension around that process. Almost like a blockage. It needs to be removed. If your toilet was blocked, you wouldn't ignore it. You'd get it sorted, you'd unblock it yourself if you could. Ideally get someone else to do it. You wouldn't ignore it. So if there's a blockage that's been getting in the way of that natural sleep process, it needs a little bit of attention to remove that blockage. So that from now on, you get back to the process of being able to drift off to sleep in that natural way that you were born to do this so easily to just let go of that blockage it can almost feel like you're resetting your sleep You're resetting the button back to the factory settings like a computer. Resetting it so that you can go back to the process, the ability to just sleep easily. and effortlessly without any kind of drama or thoughts or worries or concerns because that stuff just needs to be left on the bedroom floor So when you get into bed, maybe the last item of clothing you take off, for me it's my socks. You can have those socks represent all of those concerns that were in your mind before you took your socks off and just let them drop to the floor and when you actually get onto your bed even sitting on the bed you can experience that sense of relaxation that's naturally attached to the bed. It has a deep connection with your sleeping state.
and the two go together so well your bed and your sleep fit together like a glove so cosy so connected so safe that deep connection of just into the mattress of your bed really enjoying the feeling between sleeping and letting go as soon as your head touches the pillow your body automatically relaxes and your mind automatically slows down Because there is nothing that needs your attention. There's nothing to think about. There's nothing. to say and there's nothing to do just a really nice and calm experience just enjoy feeling relaxed and tired so relaxed so very tired 
so relaxed. So tired. Drifting away. Drifting away.
て、お帰り
て
हो